beauty. Can I make this have to our life? Find out on this brand new shirt. Beauty doesn't matter. No, but see, eh, yeah, when you basic understanding anyway. Not really. It is really. Hello, whether you're binge watching or you just clicked on this week's episode of Blue Tick, welcome to the show. My name is Atara and you're watching this on Evolt Africa. Blue Tick. All right, welcome back. Let's get straight to it. I can't wait for you to meet my guest. I have Yemoli. Hi. Hello. Welcome to Evolt Africa. Yeah, thank you for having me. Okay, all right. And Mr. Hyenana, welcome to Evolt Africa. How are you doing? I'm good. All righty. Okay, so let's get to it. Your name, Mr. Hyenana, it came from a joke or something I would consider a joke. It was from a red carpet, if I can remember clearly. You were asked a question yeah. about uh, what's the baby hyena called? Yeah, what is the name of a female, female hi yeah. and then you said hi yeah, no, no. <laughs> was that planned I don't know, yeah. it was planned no, it wasn't it wasn't it just was, the thing is um i've always acted like that i like saying rubbish <laughs> <laughs> yeah i like it. rubbish is good Good. Wow, okay. Yeah. So I've been doing that with Alibaba for like five years. So uh -huh. the opportunity came on I mean, a, a platform called Cracks TV yeah. for the Awa Live show. Mm -hmm. So they asked me the question and I gave them something I have on the inside of me. Wow. A rubbish answer. And then that name stuck from then. And that, that was it. Okay, would you consider that point in time as your breakthrough moment? Yeah, that was it for me. It, it's the rubbish, the name Ainana for me. Because it was 2017, and I'd, I'd been in the industry for years, for over eight years before then. But when I, I named a female, it was an maybe naming ceremony, and that really blew me. Aww. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yemoli, let's get to meet you. Who is Yemoli? Uh, Yemoli, rather. He does a lot. You're an actor, you're an entertainer, you're an influencer, you're everything in the media industry. How did it start for you? Uh, so. Getting into the industry started off as very much on Instagram. Okay. Uh, after graduating, I mean, I left school, came back to Lagos, got an apartment at Ogba in the Kedja. So usually when you graduate from school, there's, there's this question of what next? You know, a lot of graduates don't know what to do, especially when you don't have parents to give you a job. Mm. You don't have platforms, you don't have support how you get. So when I go to Lagos, I'm like, how do I break through in the industry? So I just started, you know, working with Arule initially. Big shout out to Arule. I mean, he's one of the people that will always be in my good books for life, you know. So I started working with Arule. Sometimes he puts me on some skits or adverts. So people started, ah, oh, I like that guy. It's funny, it's good. So I tried to like start making my own videos. The engagement was pretty low, but you know, regardless, I didn't give up. So Instagram, Instagram, Instagram. I think after about two years, I had a couple of alter egos. I did on Kuma um, Engineer, I did so many, so yeah. many, you know, so. But I think the big breakthrough on the internet started from Uncle Margaret. And so far, so good. Um, what is the, you know, income like? Since you didn't even start off as, uh, with a nine to five, rather. I feel I was made to do this because after, after the online scene came, I started getting acting gigs as well from Beardo Steven and a couple of producers in the industry, you know, then, Nightlife, which is like major, major what I do now, came after a while. Yeah, so it's been amazing, okay. so to say. Just I'm grateful for growth. Like, I'm talking about the money aspect of it. Like the money, why not? I'm cashing out every way, every online. I mean, I think I'm one of the most expensive influencers. I'm not even capping about and why it. Why is that? Yes, because my lifestyle is expensive. Okay, before we go on a quick break, I have one question. I have met you on uh, red carpets, I've seen you at events. But I don't know why somehow I felt like you had gray hair, you are like older than you look now. I But now seeing you, I'm like, okay, this guy's young. Yeah, young and, yeah, he is. Both of you actually, both of you are young and obviously not married, maybe in a very serious relationship. I don't know, that's why I'm asking. And also I saw that you were, you are rather a close friend of Larry Foreman, yeah? 
Yeah, that's yeah that's you were amongst true. his groom men. Yeah, that's okay, true. so now that guy, he's married. Yeah. What's your take on marriage? When do you plan to get married? Well, I'm waiting for it. Yeah, everything about it, basically. Yeah, yeah. It's time. I'm waiting for marriage. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, exactly what, that's exactly what I'm waiting for. Okay. I, I, I think um, ladies have been using me a lot. Wow, yeah. it's not the other way yeah. around. I think what we're really going to it was him. Are you tearing up? Want to look me get the gun because <laughs> most of those girls they know that once they get closer to me, I used to go out. You understand? Yeah. So they use me as a platform to get to their husband. <laughs> <laughs> you understand? Know, like four, four of my exes are married now. Oh, okay. So that's because why you thought, left them. That no, no, they left me. That's why I'm telling single people: if you really want to get married, date me. Along the line, in the process of dating me, you would meet your husband. You cannot miss it three oh months. Oh my goodness. Fact, this I, is you trying to dodge the question. You don't want us to know when you're going to so get married. Retreat. What's the question again? When do you want to get married? Do you see yourself getting married? I'm getting married soon though. But my girlfriend is in a relationship. Oh and I know she is the one. So, so I'm not feeling bad. Okay. So, so I'm just saying, okay, probably you she's an IT. You understand? So she's you're a, walking your way to, you know, take yeah, her out of it. She's an IT. She's an IT. You'll soon break up. The yeah. guy's relationship is to spoil every September 4th. I'm just waiting. <laughs> but I'm not looking. I'm not smart. Too. What yeah. about you, Molly? Me? For yeah. what happened? For marriage. <laughs> <laughs> what, is, well, what is it with marriage? You guys no, are. No, no, I'm married. going to get married. Why not? I okay, have. So when? Soon. I have someone I'm going to marry already. So. Shout out to her. Yes. What's her name? Her name is Aitayo. Oh, that's um, nice. And? I'm just trying to gather up, you know, a few things together. And when it's time, you guys will you see time. it now. Okay, it's we are here. We will wait and we will definitely attend the wedding. Yep. Let's take a quick break. When we return, more questions for Hyena and, of course, Yemoli. Welcome back. We still have Yemoli and Mr. Hyena in the studio. This is Blue Tick on Evil Africa. I remain Tara. Okay, back to the converse conversation. Anyways, with all the money that you guys make in the industry, has there ever been a case of, you know, you've been duped one way or another? Duped? Online? Or just... Like duped in general? Uh -huh. As someone who makes a lot of money? Yes. Uh, travel agents have duped me a couple of times. You know, sometimes, at some point, I wanted to travel out. I don't want to go to America by fire by force. You know, so I think that's... The only place and at the clubs sometimes to <laughs> the hard extra, extra money to your drink. So it's just not okay, really that bad. Well, I think the first time I was duped and, and the only time was like um she, ten years ago. You know, because so I've been in the industry for like fourteen years now, okay. ten years ago. When someone sent a system to me, a laptop to me from Yankee, I told the person I need something to edit my system, yeah. After saying laptop and I went to computer village that I want to install Windows, you understand? So they collected 20000 for me to install Windows. I paid though, I bought money to pay. They now told me that the Windows cannot work well. Like it is Windows, I, I will need window blind. <laughs> so that virus will not be entering. So yeah. they put window blind in. I mean, I don't know what Windows be. And they say they say I have to put window blind. But I know what window blind, I know the importance of window blind. And I pay a shot as a kid for window blind. I think that's the first time I've ever been duped. Okay. With some window blind. Uh, <laughs> and I think I've, I've been duped sexually too, a couple of times, you know. <laughs> yes, mm -hmm. yes. No, you have to explain for that. You yes, no. for example, you send money, they will not come. Oh. You understand? <laughs> <laughs> All this type oh of words to uh, the ones that would like for you that I'm a squatter. <laughs> Okay, yeah. yes. There's no more time there. Interesting. <laughs> and there's a law against that now. Change your way, mm -hmm. There's a law against Please, that now. You need now. to sanction those people. If you charge money, I do not come. Uh -huh. uh, it's a crime. That's why I just... Force pretense. I just move my hands yes. anything that concerns... Isha Olu Alenshi. Anyways, I have to let them go because I have to give them some shots. Or oh, not me. My producer is going to give them sh some shots. When they answer some questions, we'll find out how... Intelligent they are indeed, you know, at the end of the day. But last question before you go. Um, we see everything on your social media. Some some of us wonder, is this what they do? You know, is this how their real life really is? Or this is just social media? Uh, well, I think uh, me personally, I have... I have a lifestyle, do you understand? A lot of people know how I move. So basically, what you see online is my life. The only thing is... People meet me in person and... They were like, is this, 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 is this,
the content you guys signed for is what I'm giving you online. So sometimes when I'm out, I'm not online. I'm extremely gentle and kind. Yeah, you look like. Yes, extremely gentle. The only time I'm hyper is when I'm in the club and I'm drunk and hey, I watch my snaps. I'm only shouting and stuff. But on a normal day, in my house, I'm either sleeping you know, or playing games. That's all. Okay. Apart from that, everything online is. It's pretty much the yes. same, Mr. Hayen, and are the same. Oh, there's some aspect uh, of This you. is my reality. You understand? I don't claim what I'm not. Exactly. You understand? Yeah. I, I'm not trying to impress anybody. Okay. So you come to my page, you follow me because you like that this guy is real. Mm. Uh, if I if I use a car for, for my skit or whatever, I will tell them, this is not my car. Mm -hmm. So just stop using me as prayer point. You understand? Uh, so I'm just a real person, a spontaneous person. Yeah. And that is what I portray. Okay. So that's my reality. All right. Thank you so much. I love this. Thank you for answering our questions without holding back. I really appreciate you coming through. But before we let you go, finally, like I said, there's just a little bit short for you two to take. Blue tea. And we do the same one. When they are together, apes. <laughs> <laughs> this is your fucking trade, I swear. A group of monkey apes. <laughs> Head of State, um, Yak General Yakub Gohan, um, MQ Abila, um, Tinubu Ashele, Abila Miniki, Omar Sanjo, Mohamed Buhari. He was the pre he was, he was um, a president for one day. There was a competition organized by Pick Milk. Boss, boss, I enjoy it. Sir. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we surely shall see the sun shine soon. 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 We surely shall see the sunshine soon. We surely shall see the sunshine soon. We surely shall see the sunshine soon. Celebrities have dual lives. Find out on this brand new show. It doesn't matter. No, but see, yeah, it's when you basic understanding anyway. Not really. It is really. Uh... Yeah. Is it a... Beauty. Beauty. Beauty.